I'm Brent, you're watching Team Culture. Welcome. If you're a new viewer, or welcome back to our longtime viewers. We appreciate you. Well, you know, carpet is a big deal. In fact, it's $11 billion worth of big deal. That's how much selling of carpet goes on in the United States each and every year. 48% of the floor covering in the United States is carpet. So there's a lot of carpet being made. And of course, for thousands of years, carpet was made by hand. In fact, people pay big money to get a handmade carpet. Well, like most things with the industrial age came along and everything was mechanized. From the use of mechanical looms to mechanical yard uh, twisters and spinners that were all powered by steam. But did you know that steam is actually used in the production of carpet? That's right. Two things we're gonna talk about. One is heat setting that has to do with the durability of the carpet and the other is dyeing where it gets its color. Now in the heat set process, they take all that uh, yarn and fiber and they twist it together. And it's super important that it stays twisted or else your carpet looks frayed and breaks apart and doesn't hold its uh, that nice twist. So what they do is during the twisting process, they will literally hit it with steam and that opens up the fibers and then they will cool it, which draws the fibers in together, which makes that nice tight twist or pile is another word they use. Well, when it comes to dyeing the carpet and putting all that nice color in you use like that salmon colored plush carpet you used to have in the 70s, well, they have to draw the dye into the actual twist or fiber. So one of the reasons they use steam is because of the properties of heat. So they literally will dunk a bunch of carpet into a bunch of dye uh, and inject steam into it, but also then hit it with a vacuum so that it sucks the color literally into the carpet fibers, which makes it long lasting and it retains that, um, that good color uh, for a long period of time. So steam, heat setting, dyeing, making carpet, you can Google all those things and find some great stuff, but you won't find anything better than you're gonna find on our site. Boiling points, steam cultures. Go back and look at some old ones. They're really nostalgic and good. And I was a little skinnier then. You might wanna see me a little lighter than I am now, all right? So come and join me next week. I will have something for you. See you then.